this. It even smells new in here. They just made it like a week ago. You're kidding. No. Got keys for the doors right here. And you even got a side door. Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay guys, we are, we're back with our brand new trailer and it's a big son of a buck. So this locker will fit in there. So we are gonna pick this locker up and let's see what we got in here. Okay. Trevin seven transistor. Yeah, this is old. I'm thinking this is probably the sixties. I'm guessing. If anybody knows comment but it looks it says great it's got genuine leather on it let me look around here guys this John Deere that's going to the fleet everything you see in here this is pretty much unless we start finding some killer items in here we haven't even been able to get to the back of this unit yet because there's so much stuff piled there's a up. lot we haven't gone to we were only we did manage the other day just to look up in the boxes at the, the top, top over boxes. here this is a conglomeration over here where we can't get, so we're gonna to have to dig this out. And what we're gonna to try to do is put all the flea market stuff in the very back or front of the trailer, however you wanna put it. So that's going Saturday, and I'm gonna try and take some of the little pieces of furniture or whatever and sell them on Facebook. And uh, wow, all these reels, I remember them from the other day. All these cassettes. Here's a fish eye model 20. This is old stock here. It's hey. Oh! Oh! Look at that putter! This is a John Deere. It's a very good name. <laughs> this lawnmower with brass catcher. See if I can fire up that mower. John yeah, Deere's make good. sure it's got this thing here. It's going to just drop down. Oh, there's nothing in it? No! I don't like that. All right. All right, let's pull this bad boy out. See if it works. Here, oh, hang on. Doing this yeah. Some momentum going here, you know what I mean? Yeah. Right now, our momentum is not going. Well, what the hell is going on now? I'm going to have to start editing again. All right, I see what they've done. Well, they winterized it and they broke it down. But this will have to come out. Oh. I think it's 75 to 100 dollars. What do you think? Maybe more? I don't know. Yeah. In that range? Well, yeah. If it was a little cleaner, it'd be worth it. I saw that the other day, but I didn't really know what it was and we had so much go. What, what I didn't see this. This is I thought I did. What is that? Looks like headphones. Flight Deck Crewman's Impact Resistant uh, Pilots oh. Training Helmet. Oh, look at that. It's got, yeah, I can see that now. 1986. No. It's 50 bucks. Yeah, that's a good eBay item right there. That's nice, man. Show them that. They like the close ups, man. Yeah. Well, that's something, guys. That's definitely at least 50 for sure. Okay. Well, Story the, oh, look, The Wizard of Oz Storybook Collection. Well, that might have some value to it. Yeah. That movie actually hit its 80th, 80th year yesterday. 80 years since they released it back in 1939. Wow. Yeah. One of the classic movies of all time. We got a Windows 7 uh, desktop. Yeah. And monitor. This and speakers. That probably would sell for something. I'm sorry. I'm oh, not. wait a minute. What do you got? What do you got? Like flags. I mean, really cool ones. All right, let's see if we can. Yeah, like a checkered flag. Oh, this is NASCAR stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, look at all the Hot Wheels. All right, all right, all right. It's getting better, guys. Yeah, we got some a whole thing of NASCAR stuff here. Okay, let's see this flag. Hot Wheels, brand new. Yeah, that's the. Is that the checkered flag? I guess it is, huh? Okay, well that's something. Wait, what does it say? Oh. I don't know. That might be an eBay item. Okay. Micro machines. Ooh. A few dollars in there. 
going to need a lot to get, get back our money. Well, like I said, most of the time in these units, the best stuff is in the back. We're back on, guys. We took us a little soda break or a Super ice, hot today. ice tea break. We see, I see a box right here that says collectibles. So, hey, so we're not going to give up yet. There's still the whole back row here, so... Well, other than the what was up here in the corner, and it wasn't very good. Maybe we just got the crappy stuff. Uh, oh. oh, boy. Uh -oh. Well, we see a clock. Does that ring fake? This yeah, of Wonder course. Wonder Woman clock. Wonder Woman? Oh. Yeah, these are... Uh, oh, there's some Hot, hot Wheels. Wheels. Okay, there's Man, a buck. The this is Wonder Woman lunchbox. We got a... Uh, Batman thing. Tons of Batman memorabilia. All right, oh, that goes in this. Oh, that's something. I think we got a few dollars here if we can manage not to bust it all up. Uh, very little. Marvel. Oh, boy. We got a couple of new uh, Marvel Comic Digest. Digest. Yeah, these might be a couple of dollars. Flash Cup. Yes, a few things. It's yeah. That's money right there. Oh, yeah. It's kind of tore up a little bit, but that's good. Maybe a little bit. We got comics in here. Ooh, I see jewelry down there, too. Really? Yep. Oh. It doesn't look promising. Uh, this thing's full of comics. Yeah, this isn't any good. Well, comics are good if they're older. Maybe, well, yeah, this isn't they're any not. good. Sometimes newer ones are pretty good, too. Yeah. Let's show Justice League. Two dollars and ninety nine cents. You know they're new and they're two ninety nine. <laughs> okay, well there's a yeah, few dollars there's here. There. There's some more uh, spider. There's some Spider Man. All right, thanks. More comics. Batman. Batman stuff. Those are pretty good right there. All right. I'll probably get a dollar piece. So there's about twenty bucks there's, there. This is in a case. It's We're in a frame. very, it's on, it got a barcode on there, which doesn't help much. Wonder Woman sign and a Batman That's sign. Those are, okay. yeah. That was a good box. These always sell for some reason. I don't because know. they're aluminum and they're worth money. These right here are probably worth five to ten dollars. You hear that, guys? We're going to have to five and ten dollar our way out of this mess. Yep. We, we need some high five items is what we need, man. All right, let's show them this. This is good. There's no name on it. Does it have a... You'll see it in the bottom middle. There should be a number, maybe an eight. A ten. A ten. Okay, it's a ten. Uh, this one's going to be worth about ten dollars. Do not... Remember, do not forget that ten dollars... If we can find 80 items like that, we're... Uh, Pretty good. Shape. Yeah, eighty-two dollar oaks. Yeah, eighty-three actually. Actually, all you need is five twenty-dollar items, twenty ten-dollar items, twenty thirty-five dollar items, forty-three dollar items, and two hundred one-dollar items, and we double our money. Yeah, there you go. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and that get. That is what you call a bucket of junk. Bucket of junk. All right, we ready to get into this? Yeah, we need to get into this. This is gonna probably be our last hope here, because I've looked in this thing and there's nothing in it. That chair's okay. It's got an ottoman. That's probably gonna be forty, fifty bucks with an ottoman. This is the last of it. Yeah. This is all she wrote. This is an. Cool, was this an onwar? Well, it's no. Oh, the daggone door's cracked over there. It's, it's, a it's pine. Here. It's not working. Here we go. Oh, there's a box right here. Looks fancy. Oh, all right. Well, let's see. Come on. Oh, hell yeah. Please Whoa, tell dude. me they're in there. Oh, there is coins is in it? your... Quarters. Oh, a quarters. Okay. Well... Well, there's at least a dollar twenty-five in each one of those, then. Yep, a dollar twenty-five. I mean, is it one, two, three, four, five, 
Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, well, I'd say we get a premium for these. They're like there's what, twelve fifty? In look at this. But maybe there's something here. Well, there's old coins. There's a well, silver. That. That's silver. That's a barber quarter. I recognize that. I'm a coin collector. 1909. That's probably worth th uh, five dollars or better. Barber dime. That's a mercury. Uh, mercury. Uh, mercury dime. That is probably worth two dollars. 1919. Oh, that. Wait a minute. Give me that 1919. That's in really good condition, man. Here's a 1919 W. Well, there's no W. Yeah, that's what it says, W. There's no way. There's no such thing. It's not showing up on the camera. Let me see it. It says W. There's no W. Well, first, first, man, it's, not, it's, not it's either a D or an S. If it has a mint mark, because they've been either Denver or San Francisco. It says W. It's a W. Where are you getting W? There's no... There's a W right there. Oh, my God, dude. That is freaking W. Yeah, what is it, then? I can't see it, but it, if I had my jeweler's loop, I would show Let me look it up. Might as well put that in Johnny's box, too. That ain't gonna help much. What is this junk? Well, it's... Struts. Yeah, I don't think those are used struts, though. They're not any good. I don't know why Lots they didn't... Those are nice. Jeans. Oh, some of those old jeans can be worth some money, dude. Especially if they're red line jeans, man. Maybe they got red lines on them. That's probably a couple of bucks. One more drawer down there, too. Yeah, then the rest is just loading, I think. Then we're going to end up loading. They're not going to watch us do that, so. These are... They're huge. South Pole. Mm hmm. It's a little bit too big for me. You gotta go down here. Look at the inside. They do look ready. Not old. Uh, not exactly the ones we were looking for. Well, at least there's a lot of them. Maybe those will sell. Yeah. Just let people rifle Super through those. Hot. Yeah, I mean, it looks like rat poop. American Eagle. That's good. Yeah. Okay, well, there's something. It's better than what some of them are. I think that's it. Let's see. Johnny? Johnny, you didn't help. Oh! Wow. Gold coins? United States of America presidential dollars. Cool. Okay, well there's oh, about twenty about twenty dollars there, maybe thirty, twenty-five dollars. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four dollars. Thirty-four dollars, guys. That's Missing something. Yeah, that's okay. Hey, yeah, but less there's, there's the this this looks like a gun box, dude. I've never seen what it looks like this. Thompson. Ooh, Thompson. Come on. Yes! Oh, yes! No way. <laughs> what is it? Oh, we got oh, a two! There's two! <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> a... Shh, we don't want them knowing that we got. I know, but. Gun. Wait a minute. What is it? 32. 32? I've never heard of a 32. 32. That's... Oh, it's wow. It's definitely Smith & Wesson. Smith & Wesson. That is old, dude. I've never seen... I've had a bunch of these, but I've never seen one this... What's... It's definitely old. You can tell by the is frame. Is there some dates here? Look on it. Springfield, Massachusetts. Oh. Yep. Thought us. March 27th. 
1994. That would, no, that's 1894, dude. That's not 1994. That is 1894. May 21st, 95, July 16th. Those 95. are those are manufacture dates for I think. There's a bunch of dates on here, dude. There's 84, 39. I don't think it's that old. It's not loaded. There's a uh, serial number right there. Yeah. Uh, I'll cover it up just in case. 524. I think all the parts blah, blah, blah. had serial numbers on them. Yeah, when I had mine, let me try to look it up. I can look up the... Yeah. Okay. See, that's... Look at that. That's beautiful, though, man. I'm excited about it. I mean, for this unit, this this is sweet. I'm going to make a thumbnail out of this. Wait, let me see. First hit in this unit, really. Well, I mean, we've had some other ones. This is definitely the best. Wow, that just turned around something amazing. See, you never know. Yeah. I think this, I'm going to say this is probably worth at least $300. We're going we're gonna to see over here. We got some workers over here that I think they would love to have a bottle of tequila. We're going to see if they want it. Tequila! You want? Tequila! <laughs> Yours! Free! You can have it! Yeah. Yeah, okay, I'm, I got yep. this one right here so, was on eBay for how much? These are all the concert tees. We just looked them up. It's $189 sold at auction. $189. Bucks. This one's in great shape for the most part. Yeah, very good. Some of them show a little bit of wear. Right, let me fold them up the way they're supposed to be. You know what's, what's funny is a lot of times when you give things away, it tends to make money come at you better. <laughs> It does. It's like when you're generous, it comes back, man. Yeah, man. It, it does. It's true, man. There's a 2000 Metallica shirt. It's a yeah. 50 to 70 dollar shirt. You see, guys, this is like dressers and, and nice furniture, but it doesn't take up the space. And I'm talking about in the dollars that we can sell these this things is for. A 2000 corn shirt. Second oh, wow. Twice. That's a 30 to 40 dollar shirt. Corn was a little after my time, and I didn't really get into it. They were okay. They kind of died off pretty fast. Yeah. Back in the day, we would have probably listened to a little bit of that, but there were so many great bands back then. This, is right here, guys. this one is like 100 bucks plus on eBay. Yeah. $100 right here. So you're looking at, we're just making all kinds of money. This unit today that we we, we dug out of, we bailed out with with uh, with Smith and Wesson bailed us out of that one, guys. Let's face it. But this other locker, it wouldn't have mattered what we got in this. We're gonna this make all kind of money. This is a two hundred dollar shirt right here, but it has a hole right here. So it so went we to think a, we'll get about fifty. To yeah. For it. Somebody will fix it, or somebody really won't care. It might go for more. You know, uh, some people they don't care about that. It, it, it kind of adds to the vintage look, real. Cool. Like the hipsters, they're the ones paying these ridiculous prices. Anyway, uh, Pink Floyd, right the here, wall. This, I think, might be the cherry of this little batch here. It, it's right up there with the, that first one. This is also a $200 shirt. Yes, this right is. There. Yeah, I remember that back in the 70s, I believe. Or was, yeah, it's been a minute. Crazy. There's and Douglas. this one right here, this is... A sweatshirt, Pink Floyd. Yes. 1987. I think we'll get at least a hundred out of this one. Hundred bucks. Yes, that is nice. On auction, guys. We don't have to wait for this money. This is stuff that people fight over right here. So right there, you got. 
minimum five hundred dollars in concert tees. Minimum. And that's just in one little box. And I think there's more than that. I think there's more money in it than that. We've got more shirts right here, jerseys. It's George Carlin. That's a great one, Simon. Yeah, says, Simon says go f yourself. <laughs> yeah, we can say that. There's a Celtics this jersey, a, Kentucky Wildcat jersey, corn, corn. Hey, if you like corn, you'd want that. And then all these jerseys, I haven't looked them up, but we will. Hang on a minute. No, that's a Fender shirt. Yeah, and the rest of this stuff over here, guys, we've dug out of that unit today. Well, some of it. I pulled a few things out of the, out of, uh, the older inventory, but... Uh, this is going to be like a flea market oh. lot. This right here. Oh, yeah, we got Jimmy. $75 toy. Yeah, Jimmy Hendrix. This is the man. Nobody can play guitar like he and could. And this right here, this is a $100 book right here, guys. Uh, yes, this was. The Anarchist Cookbook. Mm -hmm. Copyright 1971. Wow. It's $100. And they sell very, very well. You don't want to know what's inside this book. We'll put it that way. Yeah, you don't want to know that. And if we uh, said it, we probably would get demonetized. Yeah. <laughs> so we can't say it. But you can do your own research and figure it out. Yeah. So there we go. Uh, and the rest of this is going to the flea market. It's going to be great blowout stuff. Yeah, and we're not done yet. There is, We've got inventory that we've built up from other units that we're going yeah. to dig out. But a lot of this came from today. That unit, we, we got bailed out at the end with a few things. We're going to have a really good lot here for the flea market pickers and buyers. They are going to really love to go through this stuff. Even Douglas loves it.